These cows at a breeding centre in Jaipur aren't just well-fed and looked after, they even have their own minister. Otaram Devasi comes from a traditional cow herding community. The Hindu nationalist BJP party appointed him as Rajasthan's cow minister, India's first, three years ago. His job is to make sure the animal, which is sacred to India's Hindu majority, is well protected. We consider the cow as our mother. We believe that God resides within her. But the humble cow has recently become India's most polarizing animal. Right-wing Hindu groups are accused of whipping up hysteria across the country, warning that the cow is under threat. Hindu vigilante groups have attacked trucks they suspected were illegally transporting cows to slaughterhouses. Organizations like the Rashtriya Gauraksha Dal or National Cow Protection Group have even targeted restaurants for serving beef. Many Hindus consider eating it taboo. The group's firebrand Hindu leader, Kamal Didi, accuses Muslim traders who dominate the meat industry of rampantly smuggling cows. On the outskirts of Jaipur, Kamal Didi meets her volunteers. They tell her they rescued a cow from smugglers after an informant tipped them off. The group says this bull was intentionally injured to make it easier to smuggle. Kamal Didi says she won't shy away from violence if needed. We will do whatever it takes to save cows. We won't let cows be slaughtered. If anyone even looks at a cow, we'll gouge their eyes out. We're not scared of the consequences. The campaigns to protect cows even saw a mob in Rajasthan recently lynch a Muslim farmer. He later died of his injuries. These images, taken on a mobile phone, sparked outrage in the country. Otaram Devasi, who is from the ruling BJP party, says state laws ban the slaughter of cows and they have to be respected. If anyone is found smuggling cows, the police have to be informed and they will take action. We have made provisions for that in Rajasthan. No one should take the law into their hands and endanger people's lives. But that has done little to ease concerns in Rajasthan's cattle industry. These traders say the political tension over cows has badly affected their business and struck fear into Muslims. Now cattle traders are really worried that they will be stopped or beaten up or that their cattle will be confiscated. Traders from outside Rajasthan are no longer coming to cattle fairs. Muslims are associated with slaughterhouses and the moment you have a Muslim name, these vigilante groups target you. They don't care if you're innocent. They just start beating you up. It's very scary. Passions run high among members of the vigilante group. Protect the cow, protect the nation, they shout. India's holy cow is embroiled in a very unholy mix of religion and politics.